Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to Game Aim Plus, where my aiming is gaming. I'm your host, the boy G, and oh, we are gonna talk about it. Let's talk about it. Okay, Nintendo Direct, okay, has announced Tomb Raider 1, 2, and 3, okay? Remastered, all together, collection, bundle, coming to the Nintendo Switch. Do you understand what I am telling you here? Okay, this is awesome, okay? You're, that's why you are probably wonder why am I playing, why am I wearing a PlayStation shirt? Okay, because, okay, the original Lord Croft, the Tomb Raider games, they were on PlayStation, okay? Back in the day, so I never really even got a chance to play the Tomb Raider games, okay? I always thought Tomb Raider was cool, you know, she was a cool chick with two guns, doing cool stuff. I liked it, but I never really got a chance to play it. I think I played it a little bit, like, a little, little taste at my, like, my friend's house. But not enough to, to remember it or even get far or do anything. Maybe I just shot somebody and got off the game. I don't know. But never got a chance to play it, okay, on PlayStation. Because back then, I was very anti-PlayStation. I was more on, you know, Team Nintendo 64, baby. You know, so didn't really get, nah, didn't play it. So, but now this is, this is super dope. Because now it's coming to the Switch in a whole triple pack, okay? So, I, I, I'm, I'm liking that. I'm digging it. Okay, it's like, it's, it's three games in it. I didn't even know it had three games. I thought it was only like two Tomb Raider games. Nope, apparently there was three, you know? But yeah, there's three games in one. And it's really cool because in this remake, remastered, okay, you can toggle, like you can go back and forth. You can play it, you can play the games in the old graphics, you know, or you can play them in the new graphics, okay? That is super cool. I kind of wish like every remake game would do that. That way people that didn't get a chance to experience the old one could try it out a little bit. You know, try out the old version of the game and then try out the new one to see the, the enormous, like, huge differences between the two versions, you know? And I think that's really cool because people don't ever get a chance to uh, really get to see that, you know? People, especially the people that are the, the newer, younger generation, they never got to play those old games back, back then, you know? So this would be a great chance for everybody to do that. And I like that you could do that with these Tomb Raider games, okay? Okay? That is so cool. You get to go from old to new or new to old. And it says you can do it from at any time you want. So I guess like in the middle of the game, if you want to just go old school, you can. If you want to go new school, you can. Okay, I'm not trying to do the Nintendo Snap thing, but uh, it's, it's doing it. You know, you know, <laughs> like the Chinese guy. Yeah. But yeah, so I'm loving that. And then uh, it'll give me a chance to actually get into these games because I play the I play the Uncharted games. And basically Uncharted is basically what Tomb Raider is just as a with a female. Play as Laura Croft, and then in Uncharted, you play as Nathan Drake. You know, so basically the same things. You know, you're shooting, you're, you're going on ancient journeys, looking for artifacts and and old stuff. You know, so I'm I'm with it. You know, I want to try them out. You know, I think it'd be cool. And then I, it, like me, it'd give me a chance to go back back in the day real quick, jump into the time machine. You feel me? I get to jump into the time machine, go into the past, play these. Tomb Raider games that I've heard so much about and they're like these classic games that are like in the archives of classicness of video game history okay like Laura Croft is like probably one of the like the first females like with their own game back then you know first was probably Samus you know Samus Arian from Metroid maybe who was I don't know maybe it was Chongling I don't know let me know who the first female was I, I'm with, it was one of them okay but it wasn't Laura Croft but she was definitely one of the first ones to make it super duper big and go 3D polygraphic, you know, back then. So that's why she's so iconic, okay? And you could tell they got the features of her, especially from Angelina Jolie. Like, let's not, let's not lie. They got the whole face and the hair and the whole, just like in the movie, they got it in the game. They got it all together, okay? So the movies are cool too. Go check out the movies. Um, but yeah, you know, that's pretty much it. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty hype about it, you know, not super duper, oh my god, but I am hyped that I finally get a chance to try these games out. And especially with new modern graphics, I think it looks really good. You know, it's like it, they still look like the old graphics, but they don't. You, you go watch the trailer, man. When you're done here, go watch the trailer, check it out, and then you can see what I'm talking about. I'm not a singer, but yeah. So that's pretty much it. I can't wait for that. I'm gonna try it out. So we're gonna see what's up. You know. But there you go, guys. Gaming Plus. Please subscribe. Click that little bell button. That way, every time I upload a new video, it'll pop up on your phone like. <laughs> you feel me, dog? You feel me? But yeah, y'all have a great morning, afternoon, night, whatever it is, wherever you're at. And I'll catch you in the next one. Boo, y'all. Whoop.